welcome back to my channel and if you're new here thank you for popping by right i'm still in my pajamas because it's the same night as when i recorded the video for my empties so i've just done i'm doing three videos tonight so that'll be why anyway let's get into this i'm going to show you some of my favorite skincare products more the case of skincare for facial washes and things like that. So the first one I have is this Lacura Soothing Smoothing Facial Scrub. I really like this actually. It's a dupe for the um, the uh, simple range, but it's nice like this. Um, it does have a little a bit of a smell slightly but really nothing bad so yeah it's a cream formula oh sticky cream formula uh ah uh, that come out a bit gunky but it's a facial scrub i'm all over the place i'm so sorry so it's a facial scrub and it's nice it's small particles and i've really been enjoying that and now Talked up, so that's the first product I've been really enjoying, and I would purchase it again. This retails in Audi for 85 pence, so it's a good price, and you get 150 mils of product. The next products I've been using in conjunction with each other, I've only just bought this, but these are from Wilco. Now, if you're not from the UK, it's a basically a store a bit i think it's a bit like your target if you're from the us i'm not sure about other countries but it basically sells a bit of everything household stuff cleaning products at the minute not now but at the minute not now i mean usually does but not at this minute because of the situation we're in but anyway makeup skincare household products, cooking utensils, etc, etc, it goes on. But anyway, so I picked these up, the Skin Therapy. Now, I picked this one up a few weeks ago, and it's the Tea Tree Facial Wash. It's a creamy formula, as you can see, because it gunks everywhere, but it's nice, but it's a bit thick. It won't foam up, so if you like a foaming product, this probably won't be for you, but it actually does remove my makeup and it's pore tightening and it's got witch hazel in. So that is really nice. I'll repurchase that. That was a pound. The next one was also a pound from the same range, same product, but in this scrub. This is really nice. I've only just had it, but I really like it. It's a bit thinner formula than the first product, the Aldi one I showed you, which, if you can see. And nice small particles, not too over abrasive. And yeah, this is a nice product. I've enjoyed using this for the time I've used it. <coughs> Excuse my cough. The next one I have had a while and this is also the same range skin therapy from Wilco and it's a gentle facial scrub same sort of particles and everything this one is for sensitive skin so if your skin is prone to be sensitive then try this this is a pound as well oh I don't know why I'm trying to do that because I cut that so if you can see yeah, it's a bit awkward to be honest. I'll get some out. Okay. Yeah, down the bottom here. Right. Yeah, it's a thinner consistency to the first product again. But it's really nice. Small prop, small particles, really good. Another one I have. Oh, gross. So another one I have is the same types, gentle, smoothing, yeah, oatmeal scrub and mask. 
so you can use this as a normal face scrub it's a little bit on the runnier side so i shall show you that and there it is it's a little bit more I'm going to say more scrubby, but that doesn't help, does it? The particles are slightly bigger, is all I can actually explain it as. But it's nice as a facial scrub. And as a facial mask, you just put some of this on your face. Yeah, where else would you put it? So, anyway, put some of this on, leave it for five to seven minutes. Or if you're mean lazy, 20. So... That's <laughs> just the way I am. <laughs> I'll just sit there and watch YouTube and forget it's on. So anyway, put this on. And then when you go to wash it off, wet your face to moisture. To work the product in to make it a bit more liquidy. Because it does dry on the skin a bit. Which, you know, like a normal clay mask would. So it dries on the skin. So just wet it, move it around to loosen it again and then just rinse it off. And I've really, I've really enjoyed this as a facial scrub and I love it as a facial mask. I really do like this. Um, yeah, what can I say? It does smooth the skin out and leaves away dryness. However, I have to say to you, don't do what I did with this and use this as a facial scrub and then go in with it on the same night as a face mask because you'll end up with dry patches and have to sort that out i shouldn't have gone too mad with that but i did but i, I haven't done it since and it's a nice product i really like it i think this was 189 at home bargains but yeah, it's worth it for 150 mils. They're all 150 mils. I've not been telling you much, have I? There. The next product I have, excuse the gunkiness on the side, that's all body stuff, not body stuff, facial stuff. So, anyway, it's the Baby Soft uh, Head to Toe Baby Dove. Now, a YouTuber I watch all the time called budget glam babe recommended this on her channel i will link her channel down below she's awesome you should go and watch her she is really good and so i bought some and i use it as a facial wash as she does and i really really like this it's that will foam um let's see let's try not to drop it everywhere but as you can see it's Thin or short product, medium texture of maybe. I don't know. Anyways, medium thickness, that's where I'm going. So, yeah, I've been really enjoying it. And I like the fact that it got the pump. So, yeah, really been liking this. Lovely for a face wash. Leaves your skin absolutely gorgeous and soft. Really, really enjoy this. So, that's been really good. Anyway, guys, that's that's all for the that is all for this evening. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, smash the thumbs up, and I will see you again soon. So stay safe, stay sane, and keep smiling. Bye, everyone.